Hello, Pokey Peeps. Today, we're doing something very exciting. We're gonna be opening Crown Zenith Elite Trainer Boxes, but not just any Elite Trainer Boxes. We're gonna open the regular ETB and we're gonna open the Pokemon Center ETB. We're gonna look at the differences and we're just gonna see if we get any cool pulls. We're hoping to get that Mewtwo V-Star and anything else cool. We have the regular Elite Trainer Box. We're gonna open this first. The Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box. Let's do some opening. Okay, let's get started with the regular ETB. This comes in at about £49.99, whereas this one, is $64.99, I think, from the Pokemon Center. This is a limited edition one, so they do it on a limited run. Uh, this one is still available at all good toy retailers, but I urge you to use independent retailers. Okay, let's get opening. All right then, here we go. Scissors. This is my first opening of Crown Zenith, in fact. So, let's see. Beautiful box as usual. There's the Crown Zenith booklet. Okay, I'll show you that. This is the booklet. For those who don't know, this has a very handy, very handy list in there. It allows you to go through and tick off the cards as you get them. Oh, there's some cool stuff in there. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I cannot wait, cannot wait. Okay, let's lift that ETB box and take this out. Just in case you've never seen it before, this is what an ETB looks like. Comes like that, and then we take this little bit out, and then inside we have our packs. So there we go. In there we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten packs. 10 packs, so that's 40 pounds worth of packs. So 65 sleeves, we get a code card. Feel free to try and use that one. Lucario V, V Star. Okay, that's awesome. Black Star promo, bundle of energy, as per usual in every ETB. We get these separators. Maybe if you're new to Pokemon collecting, you don't know what they're used for, but an, e an ETB, the box, along with those separators coming very useful for sorting your cards out. We get a V-Star marker and condition markers. These are used to mark whether you're poisoned or burned, and this is to mark whether you've used your V-Star action. There we go. You end up with loads of these. It's kind of nice thing to just give away. Uh, and we've got a set of dice. Ugh, they're kind of like, mm, kind of like yellowy. I'm not sure about the color on those but they're damage markers and a regular D6, a six-sided dice. Here's a look at everything you get. The 10 packs is pretty good value, so everything else you could sort of count at 10 pounds. There we go, there's that card, if anyone wants to use it. Let's get opening. First pack, I'm gonna try and get through these as quick as I can, not only because I don't want you to have to sit there for ages watching this. I know you're probably terribly excited like I am, but, I'm terribly excited as well. Okay, Ultra Ball, Digging Duo, Sharp Shinx, Wooloo, Helicoptile, Shrek, Grubbin, B. Okay, that's nice. Okay, but we're gonna put that in the not so great pile. Okay. What have you pulled in um, in Crown Zenith? Comment below, let me know what your best pull is. Trekking Shoes, Great Ball, Gloom, Ron, Rock, Gruff, Seal, uh, Corefish, Wooloo, nice, nice reverse hollow there. Okay, that can go in the, all right, file there, gonna go in the commons and uncommons. Okay guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll keep making these videos. Also, you get a notification about part two of this video because we're just going to open this ETB, this regular ETB today. Oh, V-Star Marker, Pokemon Catcher, Traffic, Purloin, Coffin, Bidoof. I like the full art Bidoof. Okay, okay, nice, nice, nice. 
So yeah, if there's anything in particular you want to see me open, just comment below and I'll try and do it. I have some cool celebration stuff that you might want to see. We have more Crown Zenith. Okay, let's get through these. Shinx, Wilma, Baltoy. Oh, oh! Okay, okay. So to replace it with one of these, it's awesome. That is a good pull. That's definitely going in the good pile. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, that's exciting. Okay, okay. All right, let's put that to one side. Oh. All right, it makes me want to go really fast through the cards. Rescue carrier, really useful. I need some of those. Look, see, oh, I see I'm rushing through these. I can see, can I see a shine? Can I see a shine? I'm uh, Leon, nice, nice. I like these signed cards. Oh, my Lord. All right. It was good. It's great for our binder because we're going to start. Uh, we're going to start a new binder for these. So that's all good. Okay. Don't forget as well to check out some of the live streams we've been doing on Pokemon Live. They might be able to help you out if you've not played that before. Crushing Hammer, useful. Okay, Lambesta. So many of these other sets. There's a V. There's a V. There's a V. And it's alternate. Oh my god. Look at that artwork, man. Sorry, it's out of focus. Look at that. What a pull. Okay, this trainer art. Oh my god, it's so exciting. That's definitely going in that pile. Alright, next one. It's not been bad. Ten packs we've got in here. So I'm hoping for like maybe four or five, six pug pulls. Okay, rare candy. Oh my God, okay, okay, I've just seen, I think, I think, is that a V-Star? Is that a V-Star at the back? Could it be the Mewtwo V-Star? Oh, we're getting tingly. We're getting tingly, we're getting excited. I just wanna get there. I don't wanna get there too fast. Switch, always useful. Starly. Radiant Eternus, oh my God, this is gonna be an amazing pull because I'm sure there's a V-Star behind this. That's good enough. That's a cool pull. What have we got? It's the V-Star. It's not the V-Star we're after, but any V-Star is a good one. It's just a standard V-Star. Well, that's cool, isn't it? It's not the Mew. Okay, those two are going in our good pile. That's four really, really good pulls so far. Yeah, let's keep going. Oh, it's so exciting. I want to open the I want to open the uh, Pokemon Center one as well, but we'll do that in part two, and I'll try and get the film today. Okay. Here we go. I just want to get this out for you today. Blue. See how much I'm rushing now. It's because it's because the Pokemon. Um, the, the bloodlust for the, oh my god that's full art oh my god there's a there's a v behind it as well this etb is so good are these just the pull rates is everyone else pulling like this what have we got there mu v that's going in the good pile and we're going to use that in our deck we're gonna we've got the v max the mu v max deck and i'm going to replace one of them with that that is awesome. Okay, that's going in the good pile. Oh my God, what are we up to? Two, four, six awesome pulls. And I don't think we've had a like terrible pull. I just think this set's good. It's always good pull when you're just starting a binder anyway. Okay, let's get rid of that. Okay, this is the second to last pack. Let's go glue. Friends in Sinnoh, Lair on. The Cider, Energy Search. I saw some shine, but it's uh, it's just a hollow. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, all right, still good, still good. As I say, when you're starting a new binder, every pull's a good pull. It's when you get onto like the second, third ETB. Okay, let's do this last pack. So we're after the Mew V-Star. That's what we want. 
This is so many good. Or another mill tank would even be good. That'd be awesome. Because I have a few mill tanks in that deck, so. Let's do that. Potion. Never really use the potion. Seal. Does anyone else use the potion? Oh, what's this? What's this? What's this? <gasps> Magnazone. Magnazone is my friend on Pokemon Go. He comes around with me as I'm walking about. That is such a good card. This artwork is stunning. It's awesome. All right, let's see what we've got because it seems to be getting, we're getting double pulls. Oh, not this time. Still good. All right. I'm going to do a recap of what we pulled in that ETB. I think it was a great set of pulls and I cannot wait to open this. Next video, we're going to be opening the Pokemon Center ETB. But before then, I'm just going to give you a quick look over what we've got. Okay, I think we did really well from that ETB. We opened 10 packs and we got eight definite winning pulls there. One of them admittedly came with the came with the ETB and I think that'll be the same, so I'll probably have a dupe of that. Um, really good though. Okay, so that was ETB number one. Next, we're gonna compare it to the Pokemon Center. Like and subscribe, turn on those notifications so you get, um, get a heads up when we do this. Let me know in the comments below what you pulled and keep loving Pokemon.